Hey, yeah. Pack this shit up and I'll turn this shit up and I'm done and it's done and I'm done if it fall like that. What is good, YouTube? I am back for another video. Um, if you're new to the channel, uh, my name is Brandon. Uh, welcome. Uh, if you're a returning uh, viewer, subscriber, welcome back. Uh, this video, uh, as you can kind of tell with the title, is more so um, just me reflecting on some things that I've seen in our world today and really, you know, wanted to make some type of change about it. So, it's taken me almost a week, about a couple tries at this type of video, well, at this video in particular, trying to get my words straight as far as the way I feel about it, the way I'm trying to project my message, and so on and so forth. So, basically, within this whole thing, I am wanting to get the message across that us as a community, us as people, need to change and do a whole lot better. And I say that now in this take in the nicest way possible because i've recorded this video one time before and yeah I, I wasn't in the right mind frame when when going about it i was pissed i was mad as hell i i didn't know how i wanted to project it but now that i got myself together my words together as far as the way i want this message to come across you know I am in a better space for it so last Monday I don't know why but I kept on telling myself I had a thought on my mind now that I'm out here in Arizona that you know you wanted to get in and out wanted to get in and out don't even know why I want it in and out when I barely eat fast food to begin with and I was like you know what let me just go ahead and get it so as people on the West Coast know, uh, if you don't know, the East Coast, you've never been in and out on the West Coast or anything like that. It's very popular out here. There's lines wrapped around the whole entire parking lot, and really, it's about a 15 to 20 minute wait if you do not time it correctly. So, from there, I was in the line, you know, waiting, whatever, whatever, going about the whole thing. So, get up to um order order food keep pushing and there's a guy that um walks up to the car and he taps on the window whatever i let the window down talk to him he's like hey man you know just trying to get something to eat like can you help me out whatever whatever do whoop and so like i was like all right cool you know i got some cash i gave him i think like 30 40 dollars or something like that and was like you know i hear like this is cash i got and he's like hey you know you know, take care of whatever it is you need to take care of. Oh man, appreciate you, thank you, da, da, da. that's what he said back to me. Mind you, none of these interactions that I have with anybody where I'm helping them out, buying something for them, giving them money, anything like that, do I even project or in the slightest make a post about. Because it's one of those things to where like, if you have a heart, you know you want to help people, that's just something that you do you know, unconditionally, not even thinking about it without hesitation. And that's me. So I'm making this video because what I'm getting at, you know, is very disturbing in in a sense. If you got a heart and you understand, it's very, very disturbing. So after that interaction with him, I, I see him, I'm watching him like, well, he's like literally walking into the in and out And I see another guy that he was with over there um i'm assuming homeless because like the big card had a whole bunch of his personal things with him like later on finding out and he goes up to the other guy and basically like i'm from what i'm guessing i'm thinking that they're about they've been sitting there together whatever like that and thinking that they're about to split the money and basically like both get get something to eat i was wrong so the guy that I gave the money to, he basically went in, got his food, took off. Other dude is still there. So as I'm watching all this, seeing he's still trying to talk to the different people who are going through the drive-through and basically just asking for help. 
it doesn't matter how he got in, into that predicament it doesn't matter if he's asking for help like genuinely or not like it don't matter like if somebody you know if you're within the means and you know you're able to you know be a good person to help so for for me it's like okay whatever happens like after i help him out like that's that's beyond me i just know for me and my heart that i'm doing what god put me on this earth to do and that's to help people and be be a light in people's people's um lives so for me it's not no second guess no nothing and that's that's the way i keep it so as I, as i'm watching watching him ask for help and stuff like that there's about 10 15 maybe 20 people don't even know how many people have literally said no not helped them or whatever like that i'm not dipping into anybody's personal business whatsoever but if i know that i'm going to sit in a line for 15 to 20 minutes for a little burger then you know i can i can help somebody else out too so literally and 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 that's fine if people can't I'm not judging in no way, shape, or form, but the 15 to 20 minutes to not helping it, it it doesn't add up for me personally. So, as I'm as I'm watching this, I'm seeing all the different types of ways people are saying no, either not even acknowledging it in the first, or even there was one person, and this is what really made me mad and pissed off. The one person who he walked up to and tried to say like ask for help or whatever rolled down the window and physically tried to shoot and push push him away mind you he he wasn't even in like arms reach with the with the car the dude he tried to do it just just to do it and that's what sent me over the edge why are you trying to physically harm and put your hands on somebody else who is just asking for help it doesn't even matter if they ask for help or just trying to talk to you in general. Why are you even trying to do that? Because you don't want to be messed with. Just, just say something like, "Hey, you know, I, like, I can't do it right now," or wherever the case is, whatever your personal case is. That, that's all you have to, do. and be honest and truthful about it. Like that, like that's the whole thing that people like, like stop bullshitting people and beating around the bush. Just be honest and be truthful, and I promise you, it will pay dividends. But I'm, I'm, but again, watching this go down, and I'm hot, and still seeing more people denying, denying, denying. And when I get up there, I'm like, 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 what, 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 what do you need? Like, I'm, like, trying to help. Like, I'm like, hey, my name is Brandon. What's your name? His name, his name is Mark, and basically. I'm like, hey man, like this is what I can do. Like, what is what is it that um that you that you want to order? Which what, what you want to get? He was like, man, I was just asking for a double double and a, and a small drink or whatever like that. That is seven dollars. Seven dollars. Somebody tried to push him and put their hands on him over seven dollars. And that and that really like hurt me and like I like I really got pissed off then. So I was like, you know what? Like when I get around here, what I'm gonna try to do is I'm gonna try to tell them that you're gonna be inside if you if you wanna go inside to to get it and basically like try to pass it over that way and basically just try to get him the the food and whatever he wants, you know, within a timely manner. So I get around, uh, try to like add the order or whatever like that. The one lady, she was being difficult. I'm like, look, I'm not playing here. Like, like this is what I need for this person right here. Like, can can that happen? No, no, no. With that, we can't do that. But uh, you can add it to your order, and then we can give it to you. And so I like, okay, that's that's cool too. Like, it don't at this point, it don't matter what the case is. Just, just like let me let me get done what i need to get done so when i get up to the other window like they already knew what the deal was of of course and 
you know, I was like, you know what, we're gonna put it in this bag, we're gonna get this, this, that, and that. I'm like, okay, cool, perfect. So, I had to go around and park park for them to um, bring the food out or whatever like that. And he was waiting and everything. You could see his whole, like, facial demeanor and everything. Like, like, he was thankful that there was somebody who, you know, wanted to help. And I sat there for a little bit and, like, kind of, like, um, talked to him. It was, like, um, just, he was just appreciative, appreciative, appreciative. And I was, like, man, it's, like, I said I was going to do this. And I'm, man, of my word, like, like, you're okay, you're good, like, like, I'm a good person that's trying to help you, stuff like that. So, I basically, um, like, shook his hand, left, and, like, for me, I'm sitting here in a car, driving back, and I'm thinking all these things, like, why people would, you know, do certain things and be a certain way, and, like, it, it just it just wasn't clicking for me like I like I don't know why people are the way they are and like just not nicer we as people wonder why all these different things are going on in this world in this country to even simplify things and you know you have to be able to look yourself in the mirror and ask yourself who are you like who really are you and if you genuinely can look back and see all these different things that you like did to you know wrong somebody or do whatever that even like for example like what this other dude tried to do and like pushing him when there's no need for that like if you can if you can reflect and see that you did that then that is not okay in no way simple shape or form I am calling everybody out that has done that in their life and that is not okay. And really the only thing I ask is like just like one kind thing a day whether or not it's just making somebody smile or doing an act of service with somebody or helping somebody like like that for instance. Like it's 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 a simple thing. Obviously do what you know you feel like doing as far as like within your means and stuff like that. But it's like it's, it's it's that simple and you could really change somebody's life with just one little thing. Like it's as simple as a smile. And you know, like that's kind of Man, I, I don't know. I, I just don't know what more as people we need to endure or see or you know go through to even have something click and us actually want to do good you know that I, I like I, I really don't understand it but you know it's it's beyond me us as a community as people need to need to change like I said and and really you know look at things in a different way but um yeah that's kind of just my um whole thing um on a on an off topic type note it's Super Bowl Sunday you know uh put down in the comments who you had as far as the game this video will definitely be out you know after the game's over with obviously and really just go ahead and let me know who you had winning what was your score prediction at the time you know, and, and, and be honest about it. What was your score prediction at the time? And um, and let's see who, who gets uh, as close. And so, um, also from a um, personal note, I've been doing some different research and things and stuff like that as far as like different uh, video ideas and different things that I can do to make um, this channel kind of like a lot better and I'm thinking about once we, we get back to Philly uh, doing daily vlogs and trying to create like a template to make editing and posting out videos a lot easier so uh, give me some response as far as that down in the comments and you know basically let me know if that's a good thing bad thing or think you know I should just go and start doing something different as far as video wise but um, 
I appreciate you guys for basically like tuning in, uh, listening, and um, you know, just just try it one time. You know, make make one person smile within a day, and I promise you, you gonna feel better. Uh, you gonna notice a change in your world as far as like the way you view things, and you know, it's always, you know, it's just one of those things. that's like it just. I said it before, but it makes you feel good about yourself, and it's gonna it's gonna brighten your own mood, and it's gonna improve your own mental health and your spiritual health to begin with. So that's kind of um, that's the way I feel about it, and the way I have um, grown with it, and and noticing a change within my mood and stuff like that. When you know you you take on that responsibility of making at least one person smile a day. And that that will completely, you know, it will change your life. But anyway, I hope everybody has a, a great day. Uh, be sure if you like the video, like the video, uh, share out this video to help spread this word as far as being kind and changing other people's lives with one simple action. And you know, just this movement to make the world a better place. I appreciate you guys. Love you guys. See you in the next video.